And a warm welcome on what is an ideal night for football, you've got to say. I'm Derek Ray, joined by Lee Dixon in the commentary position, and we've got Champions League group stage action to look forward to. It is Bayern Munich up against Ajax. Yeah, Derek, thanks. You can't really go on and win tournaments unless you're consistent in the group stages. Very important you don't drop points. Looking forward to this one. Well, as we run the rule over the table in this group, it's all very tight and so much to play for. Well, it's absolutely perfect scenario for the neutral, that is. I'm sure all teams involved would prefer a little bit of lead in this group, but jeopardy, that's what we want in the Champions League, and we've certainly got that tonight. Coman, real chance. It has to be, surely. Fine got giving to push that away. And after that fantastic effort, it's gone out for a throw-in. Firing it towards goal. And it is the opening goal of the contest. Well, it was always going to be a tight game, but now all of a sudden, one team ahead. Things have got to change on both sides. Well, let's see that again. Oh, he's so sweetly hit. Look at his technique absolutely brilliant he's got the power he's got the accuracy and now he's got himself a goal well he's delighted isn't he we can see that calm is needed now just to consolidate this lead cool heads here is Thiago Sané, Kimmich, Saar, will he play it in? And here's Joshua Kimmich, can he put it away? What great excitement, and the match is a level. the replay what a time to score Derek kept his cool so late in the game easy to snatch at that one is there time for a winner well the goal again albeit from a different angle yes yeah, a show of emotion and why not they're back in this game on And that will do it for tonight. This group stage meeting is over and the points have been shared. Well, regardless of the score, Derek, a draw tonight, you want a game to go on forever. That was the case tonight. 90 minutes was too short. What a football match. A performance you've got to conclude that he'll be proud of. I'm talking, of course, about Thomas Müller. Well, he left it late, the lad, didn't he? But he came good for his team in the end, getting that equaliser right near the end of the game.